A few people saw my picture on Instagram and they've asked me to talk a little bit more about my lights. These are my specular lights from Spiffy Gear and they're absolutely fantastic and I've got another set coming next month. But what they're interested in is how I'm powering them. Um, there isn't an official battery from Specular to power these on location. There is a battery adapter that takes a V-mount battery. But my old drone is now kind of out of commission since the controller got stolen and I found myself sitting on about a dozen spare batteries that are just on a shelf rotting away doing nothing. So I figured I'm going to put them to some use. So I've been using them to power my LED lights. These are three cell 11.1 volt 5500 milliamp hour batteries. Specular lights require 24 volts. So I've got these running in series, so we've got essentially a six cell, 22.2 volt, 55 milli, um, 5500 milliamp hour battery, which is about 122 watt hours. Uh, so these are connected in series, going to a, this single XT90 plug. And then from there, I've got another cable that turns it into a 2.1 mil barrel jack, which just plugs in to the regular connector and then they light up. So that's it, this is how I power my specular lights on location um, and the LED lights that I used to use that I don't really use anymore. And I get a good two or three hours use out of these even at full power. Um, this has been on full power most of today and it's starting to die now. Um, there's still a little bit of light in it. <laughs> Not enough that I can use it as a key um, but yeah, you get a good, probably three hours out of it on a pair of these, even at full power. So yeah, these have been quite handy. I wish I'd brought more of them with me because I need to film some more stuff and these are dead and I haven't brought my AC adapter with me. But, uh, and I haven't brought the charger for these either. Always remember this stuff, plan ahead. You live, you learn, next time I won't be coming out with these without the LiPo charger and I won't be coming out without the AC adapter as a backup. Um, but yeah, so that's it. That's the lighting setup. Oh, I have it on one of these really cool stands that Pixapro sent me. Um, basically, they have legs that flop up when you lift the stand up off the ground. So I pick it up, you can hear it. And the legs are folded. And then basically, I can pick it up, walk it around, and then when I put it back down, the legs open up again. It's really, really handy when I was in London for a bet a couple of weeks ago um, because it meant I wasn't walking around with stand with legs sticking out and knocking into people. Um, this I could just pick it up, walk straight and put it down at the next stand and it's good to go. Um, and that's it. So that's my lighting setup for my specular lights and for when I'm using them at shows.